Pujols. You sweet son of a bitch. Am I late for the fantasy oh, draft? Dude, what are you doing? You know this isn't Quidditch, right? This is baseball. Uh, fantasy baseball? I just wasn't sure if you are talking more like Middle Earth type thing or Game of Thrones. That's not what fantasy baseball is. Says the guy wearing the crown. <laughs> this? <laughs> I'll have you know, this is the official DraftKings DK crown. And I didn't get it by rolling some hot hand in D&D. I got it by knowing stats, facts, and being an all-around horsehide diamond super genius. Check it out. Holy hobbit, what the shit is that? Uh, you know, just my giant ass brain. Sharpen like a Ginsu knife beyond the scope of mortal man. That is fantasy baseball, my friend. Teach me. <laughs> well, fantasy baseball is like any other sport. The goal is to win. How do you win? By scoring the most points. How do you score the most points? By picking players who can put up the best stats. Oh, like Satchel Paige and Ty Cobb and Babe Ruth. <laughs> uh, no, what, what? Do you have some sort of uh, resurrection spell underneath your cashmere robe there, Carrie Bradshaw? It's microfiber. No, you pick living players. Awesome players. Uh, Buster Posey, Andrew McCutcheon, Adrian Beltre, Jose Bautista. You build your team. Team? Uh... You build your team through a draft. You pick players at each position through a draft or an auction. Are you keeping up with me here, Boromir? You know what? For someone so condescending, you know a lot of names from Lord of the Rings. No, no, Pipe down, Treebeard. So, what you do is you build your team and you pick your players based on their real life Whoa, statistical. Whoa, real life? Yes, based on their real life statistical achievements. So, let's say you have Matt Kemp on your team and the Kempster hits a Grand Slam home run. That's good. You get points. Oh, so it's like Dungeons and Dragons. Yes, except with actual achievements of actual baseball players engaged in America's national pastime. Mm. You have heard of America, haven't you? Oh, America. Damn right, Grimbold, America. The OG Shire. Now, there's two ways to play. Rotisserie and head-to-head. -head. Mm, rotisserie. <laughs> Pay attention. Rotisserie, your stats accumulate throughout the season and get added to your final score. The other way is head-to-head. Sounds intimidating, right? Very. Well, I appreciate your honesty. So, with head-to-head, -head, if your stats roll back each week as you face a new opponent, after a week of play, whoever has the most points in a particular category gets the win. <laughs> Say no more, I'm in. Just show me how to get one of those badass king hats. <laughs> <laughs> you want this, do you? Yeah, you want this? I really, really do. <laughs> well, you need to forget everything I just told you. Pardon? Because the only way to nab some DraftKings shine is to get in on some DraftKings action. Uh, DraftKings? You're goddamn right, Samwise Gamgee. My name's Derek. Then suit up, Derek, because shit is about to get real. <laughs>